so it begins. And hello there, YouTube Pokemon Walkthrough 6 here. Welcome to the Pokemon White Version Walkthrough. Hoorah! I actually uh, did this before, um, but I, had, I already had a uh, uh, save game profile, so I had to delete that. Now everything is clear, and as you can see, there's a legendary Pokemon of the game. Looking badass, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. Let's get started. New game. Hi there. Oh my god. I thought you were a guy. Yes, for the first time in five generations, there is a girl professor. And her name is Professor Juniper. Oh man. Can I say shit just got real? <laughs> what is it? Oak, Elm, what is it? Rowan, and I think Birch, or whatever. But now, we got a girl. And the Pokemon's are moving. Yeah, this is boring stuff I don't even know about. Let's tell her about ourselves. Am I a boy or am I a girl? Um, hang on. Yup, still a boy. Yes, my name. My name? Hmm. Since my last name was yes in our diamond walkthrough, um, I wonder what happens if I put no. <laughs> oh, we're gonna put that. I'm putting that. Oh, no, no, no. Yes! Well, oh, I'm sorry. No! <laughs> oh, God, yeah. So your name's no. What a wonderful name. No! <laughs> Alright. And we got a couple friends. This guy, his name is Charon. I think it's a stupid name, but hey, whatever. And that girl is Bianca. Apparently, all three of us are friends. No! <laughs> uh, I want to have fun with this name, no? <laughs> no, I want you. Oh, uh, yeah. It has seasons too this time. Check this out. Pretty good graphics. Everything is just like, a lot better. So apparently this is our house. With me and Sharon. No! <laughs> yeah, apparently we're waiting for Bianca. Slow ass bitch. Oh, oh, there she is. Damn. I've known each other for a hell of a long time. They were delivered to No's house, so no kids do naturally. 
Okay, no! You <laughs> go first. Alright, let's see what we got here. Oh, there's a little reading. I fought three Pokemon, one for you and one for each of our friends. Please settle your choices politely. Enjoy your Pokemon. Professor Juniper. Alright. So we have the middle Pokeball right here, which is Tepig. We have the one on the right, which is Oshawa. And then we have the one on the left, which is Snivy. Alright, now I'm gonna I'm, I'm just gonna tell you that Oshawa. Oh my God, he is the toughest one. Oh uh, yeah, he is going to be the extremely the toughest one. Um, so I am not going to pick him. He he's the toughest starter. Tepig is the easiest, and Snivy is just in the middle. But I do well with Snivy. I've done this game a lot of times. I've tried Tepig, I've tried Oshawa. Barely any of them work, so I'm going to stick with Snivy. Snivy is my choice. No, chose Snivy. No! <laughs> Sorry, I have to get my um, stylus. Move the pokey. Alright, here we go. Alright. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon, Sharon, that one's yours. Hey, how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? Oh, never mind, I wanted to tap it from the start anyway. Everyone has chosen a Pokemon, so that's that. Hey, I know, let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca, even though there's still weak Pokemon, you shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Don't be a worry word. These little ones are weak, like you said. You have to lift them down so they get stronger. It's settled. No! <laughs> Get ready for a Pokemon battle. I should probably fix this. Oh, wrong way. Huh? <laughs> oh, too much. There we go. What I have to do? So she has a level five Oshawa, as we have a level five Snape. How dare you touch it, man. Looks like I'm in the lead. I'm more tackle to do it. There it is. Now, yeah, only typical, I don't even level up. Oh, my. Alright. Whoa! Bianca, you messed up my room. No, you're gonna be an awesome trainer someday, I can tell. No doubt. Uh, Bianca, would you take a look around you? Holy shit! What happened? Wow, Pokemon are amazing! It's a little bit so strong. So glad that I got to have a Pokemon. Oh, I'm um, sorry about your name. Completely helpless. Here, I'll destroy your Pokemon. And now it's Pokemon. Hey, John, how about you battle too? With all you know, I'm sure you can battle without turning the run into a disaster area like I did. I believe you're right. There would be no problem for me to keep the room from getting any messier. Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have the fun battling. I decided you'll be my opponent in our first Pokemon battle. Let's see what you can do, Tepig. Now naturally, as Bianca had a level 5 Oshawa, you'd expect Chen to have a level 5 Tepig. Well, you're correct. Oh, yeah, I get to go first, which is interesting. Whoa! Where did that come from?
Hopefully I can get in one more tackle. Alright. That's it. Oh, thank God. That critical hit almost killed me. And we do it a little sick. Well, my room still looks the same, but now that can even change. You know what's funny? Oh, well, I find something funny here. The funny thing, how did the pick? How did the they get on the freaking wall? There's tracks on the flipping wall. It's like the Simpsons movie, Spider Pig. Spider Pig does whatever Spider Pig does. Can he swing from a web? No, we can't. He's a pig. Look out! He's a spider pig. Anyway, um, apparently they'll be all. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna clean it up. Clean it up. No worries. I'll take care of it later. See? Why is mom? Why every mom in this game? It's like they're always awesome. But for mom, if I won. <laughs> Now go has to go home first. So apparently mom heals us up free. You know, she does that anyway. <laughs> She's gonna give you a cross transceiver. Thanks, Mom. Later. Alright. Oh, wait, Bianca, where'd you go? I believe you go in here, because they have the mailbox. I stand corrected. <laughs> you go the other way. Oh, they, they all have the mailbox. Huh. No! No, yes, no, <laughs> a thousand times, no, yes, 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 no, I'm just kidding. Oh, man, hang your head in shame. Well, I don't want to get caught up in this, but apparently she's like, fuck you, dad, I'm going on an adventure. So she's like, I need to get back in the lab. So here we go to the lab. I know, I've been waiting for you, young people. Let me introduce. What do you mean, young people? Let me introduce myself to you. My name is. Oh, 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 Professor Juniper. We know your name. Come on, come, come, children. There is not a time to take things lightly. Today is the day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, once again, my name is Professor Juniper, Juniper and I am so good when and how the creatures called Pokemon came into existence. That's unusual, you've already had a Pokemon battle, so maybe that's why. It feels as though your Pokemon have already begun to trust me. By the way, would you like to give your Pokemon a Sure. Oh, I thought of a perfect name too. Alright, I'm actually gonna shorten this. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Alright, here we are. Uh-huh, I see. Are you okay with the name Snake in a Grass? I couldn't fit it really in, so I had to shorten it. I know I'm short one ass Snake in Grass. Snake in a Grass. Such a great name. If you've already played 5th Generation, and you've seen the last evolution of Snivy, then you'd understand. Pokédex? Nice work, Tran. You've already studied Pokemon extensively, haven't you? Still, let me explain everything from the beginning for everyone's sake. 
Pokemon, a Pokedex is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokemon you encounter. So I want you to queue free to visit many places and meet all the Pokemon in the Universe region. This is my request. No! Sharon, Bianca, go <laughs> go on an adventure to complete the Pokedex, will you not? Yeah, well, you gave us our first Pokemon, so I'm getting... Okay, and yes, Professor. Thank you very much. Because of you, I can become a Pokemon trainer exactly as I've always wished. All of you thanks. You have given me the best possible answer. So there's our new Pokedex, which is pretty cool actually. It's a little high tech more than the last uh, other Pokedexes. Next, I need to teach you how to meet Pokemon. Please meet me at Route 1, okay? S since the po Professor asked us, it's okay to go on adventure, right? I can explore and maybe find out what I can do in life. I think I'd like that. Of course, Bianca. We can all travel however we want while we complete the Pokedex. Yeah, screw this, I ain't waiting. Oh, mother. Hey, no, wait up! And what did the professor have to say? She asked us to complete the Pokedex. I can't believe it. Well, actually, I can. I already knew she was going to ask. That's why I brought you three of, bought you three of these town maps. Take them with you. Oh, what a nice mother I have. Here you are, Sharon. Take good care of it. And one for you too, Bianca. But thank you so much. As for your room, no. <laughs> well, what's left of it? No need for any of you to worry. I'll take care of tidying up. Okay, no. <laughs> uh, should, I should have named my um, person E.H. Uh, e no, A? Like, like I'm Canadian. <laughs> ah, Pokemon. They're so cute, but they have enough power to destroy a bedroom. They are really something. If Pokemon like that at your side, they'll be safe wherever you go. I'll let your parents know. I hope that in addition to Pokemon, you'll find lots and lots of po places you will hike in the universe region and become wonderful adults. Have a great trip. Such a bomb mother. I use the town map, I'll always know how I am. That's certainly helpful. Shall we read Head to Route 1? The professor's waiting. Let's go, let's go. No, hurry and come too, okay? Hey. So, let's go. Hopefully I can fit this part in. No, this way, it's this way. Can't. No, I'm sorry. Bianca says if we're starting a journey together, she wants us all to take our first step at the same time. Hey, no. Let's all take our first step on Route 1 together. Alright, here we go. One, two, three! Yay! Oh, I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? Sure is. Come on, fresh is waiting. Professor Juniper, I'm sorry that I've kept you waiting. Now that everyone's here, I'll explain. The Pokédex's pages update automatically wherever you meet a Pokémon. Moreover, it's set up so that you obtain even more information when you catch a Pokémon. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokémon. Oh, shit, I forgot about that. Apparently, we have to watch this stupid boring video! Luckily, it doesn't take like two turns, it just takes it one turn, which is like incredible. I uh don't -oh. you didn't, you guys can see that, but Professor Juniper has, well, 29 Pokeballs. Who really knows one of them makes it 30? Well, she caught a pot rat. What luck was that? Did you see that just now? Here's how it goes. Step by step. First, reduce the Pokemon's health points. Pokemon that still have all of their energy is, are difficult to catch. If you can, use your Pokemon's moves to make the Pokemon you want to catch fall asleep or paralyze it. And to wrap this up in the best way, I have a gift for you. Some Pokeballs. And you better share all those motherfucking Pokeballs. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and for carrying the Pokemon you catch. I'm going on ahead. I'll be waiting for you in a cumulative town. Damn, we went over time. Crud. 
she forgot to say the Pokemon jump out at you in the tall grass. I'm heading to accumulate town too. I think I'll go too. I'm looking forward to the next town so I can go shopping for Pokeballs. Wait a minute. Hey, listen. No! Sharon, I thought for something fun. But we need to get going. I'd imagine the professor's waiting too. Would you just listen to sex seriously? Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one we see from Professor Juniper, is the winner. Huh? I see that sounds interesting. It will fill up Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please the Professor too. Alright then, until we reach the cumulative town, we'll take care of healing your Pokemon at your own house. Me and Oshawa will do the best for sure. Wow. Seems we're gonna have a little contest. Or are we? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're not going to. But anyway, that'll be it for this video. I thank you for watching our first white version walkthrough. Done and out of the way. Alright. That's so why I gotta catch you guys off. In our next video, we will be heading to Akuma Town. And I hear there's gonna be a buzz in Akuma Town. So we'll go check that out. Um, oh, and by the way, I'm not really gonna catch any Pokemon. Just go on ahead, trust me. But I have to cut, uh, I have to end the video here, so, uh, thank you for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe, share, do all that good stuff for me. So until then, this is PokeWalker6. Subscribe for more. Peace.